Hi everybody, quick video here today to talk about how to provision the SharePoint success site into your tenant. The SharePoint success site is a content pack for Microsoft 365 Learning Pathways. One of the requirements is that you must be on the latest version 4 of Microsoft 365 Learning Pathways before you can provision the SharePoint success site. But once you've updated it, you should be able to simply add the content pack. So obviously you'll need to have learning pathways. If you don't already, or you need to update it, you can either uh, provision the, the learning pathways site from the lookbook uh, by going into the lookbook.microsoft.com, go to view designs, solutions, and click on Microsoft 365 learning pathways. Once you do that, learning pathways will be in your tenant and then you can go back and add the SharePoint success site. If you need to manually deploy it or update the deployment, all the instructions for either doing the update, which is right here, updating the solution, or provisioning it manually uh, is on our GitHub site, which is PMP Custom Learning Office 365. So once you've met those prerequisites, then you can install the SharePoint success site. The easiest and fastest way to do that is to start here at the custom learning admin page in your main learning pathways site. Simply click on the dot dot dot, click add content pack and you'll see the SharePoint success site as a content pack. You'll click on the content pack which will open another provisioning uh, page template for the SharePoint success site. This creates a new site collection in your tenant that has some pre-configured uh, pages in it that help uh, with adoption of SharePoint. You don't have to strictly do that, but if um, but regardless of whether you do or do not provision the site collection, you need to come back to the custom learning admin page where you launch that from and click the complete button. This doing so adds the content pack into Learning Pathways. So now you have two content packs, the original Learning Pathways content pack and the SharePoint Success Site content pack. And now once the template is provisioned or the site collection is provisioned in your tenant, all the web parts will be able to load the SharePoint Success Site content. Or if you didn't provision the site template, you simply can start putting the viewer web part in various place pages in your tenant and point it at the SharePoint success site to surface this content. So another way, obviously, is that you could just start at the, the uh, finding the lookbook site in the solutions. And that's fine too, except for make sure that you completely follow the provision the SharePoint success site uh, guidelines to make sure that once you provision the site, you then go back to the custom learning admin center, add the SharePoint success site content pack, and you then obviously wouldn't provision the lookbook site all over again. Uh, you just want to click that complete button right away to make sure that the content is loaded into learning pathways. So those are two ways to get learning pathways SharePoint success site content pack into your tenant. Thanks.